this is the bones. This is um, one of the the bones that uh, you know wing bone. So as you see, this here is part of the wing bone. This here is the thoracic cage. As you see, the ribs. And this here is the hip or sacrum. As you can see, part of the tail bones. And then you have the spinal cord here for the back of the bird. It's all in one piece still. And this is the leg bone, the femur. Now, the tibia must not be that far. Maybe the. And then here is a, either the girdle or the shoulder bone. And the skull is pretty complete. So the neck is all there. Like between the, the neck feathers, you have all the, the, the neck. So um, it's pretty nifty. So I'm going to use these bones for, uh, you know, probably making runes or something with these bones. They're going to be used for something special. So, um, you can see the, the ribs in the rib cage. So, uh, I'm going to have to clean all of this. But you can clearly see the sacrum. Uh, I don't know how many, how many uh, holes there is. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine holes, and it's continuing. It's pretty nifty. So, this is a vulture sacrum with tail. Okay, tail finishes here. And then have the legs. And a, the rib cage, wing, back neck, head, it's pretty cool stuff. So this is uh, part of my my job is to make sure that this bird reaches the rainbow bridge and is honored the way it should be. So my museum skills, because I used to be a scientist before that, enabled me to, it enables me to be able to deal with this because I used to put skeletons together, so so I'm used to that, so uh, that's no problem. So uh, I work mostly with animals who died of a natural cause or that were hunted or trapped, and they're just donating the body. This animal died of a natural cause. It was probably hunted. We know there was a fisher in the forest, so we think it might be that. That was the person who gave it to me, a friend told me that so so it's very possible um, so I'm very uh, happy to have this animal in my life and um, we're gonna honor it the best way we can it's not for any reason that it's coming to me I'll probably have messages tonight in my dreams you know I'll meditate with it and um, you know I can still feel its spirit it's happy to have found me, so I'm pretty happy. Miigwech, I hope.